the Awake the Awake with Health Podcast. Podcast. Navigating Zambia's Economic Currents, Season 1, Episode 5. Greetings to everyone out there and welcome to a special edition of The Awakening with Kelvin. Your compass for reconnecting with the vibrant spirit and potential of Zambia. Today we're venturing into a topic that hits close to home for African diasporans in the UK. The recent news has confirmed it. The UK economy has officially slipped into a recession as of the end of 2023. But what does this mean for us, the African community abroad? And are there lessons we can draw from this economic downturn? Let's dive in. Understanding the UK recession first, let's break down what's happening. According to the Office for National Statistics, the UK's GDP fell by 0.3% in the last quarter of 2023. This marks two consecutive quarters of economic contraction, which is the technical definition of a recession. The main sectors dragging down growth, manufacturing, construction and wholesale. Prime Minister Rishi Sunak's campaign promise to grow the economy is now facing a serious challenge. E impact on the African diasporans. So what does this mean for the African diasporans living in the UK? For starters, economic downturns often lead to job insecurity, higher living costs and a tighter job market. For our community, this could mean remittances back home could take a hit, affecting families and investments in Africa. It's a wake up call to diversify income sources and perhaps reconsider our financial strategies. Parallels and lessons, looking back to Zambia and indeed across Africa, we see parallels in navigating economic uncertainties. Just as the UK's recession prompts a re-evaluation of economic policies and personal finance strategies, African countries have faced their own economic challenges and recoveries. The key takeaway, resilience and adaptability. Whether it's through boosting local entrepreneurship or supporting community initiatives, the spirit of innovation shines through in tough times. Moving forward, the situation isn't all doom and gloom. The UK's Chancellor Jeremy Hunt mentioned signs of the economy turning a corner with growth expected to strengthen in the coming years. For us in the diaspora, this could be an opportunity to engage more deeply with financial literacy, investment and even fostering stronger ties between our host and home countries to build a resilient future. As we wrap up today's episode, let's remember that challenges also present opportunities. For the African diasporans, it's a chance to reassess, regroup and perhaps redefine our economic engagement, both in the UK and back in Africa. Stay connected, stay informed and let's continue to support each other through these turbulent times. Thank you for joining me on Bridges to Prosperity. Until next time, keep building bridges no matter where you are. Don't forget to subscribe and share this podcast. Your support helps us bring more insights and stories. Got thoughts or experiences to share about the recession's impact? Drop us a comment or send us a message. Bye for now and God bless.